It's been a minute since we've looked at this next fella. Uh, we'll be looking at some Al Murray. Why the British never went to the moon. Now, this will be a very short reaction, I do believe, because it's only a minute and 57 seconds long, this clip. But interested to hear his take on it because uh, his, number one, his knowledge, but also his, his take on things. And his, the, <laughs> he's just funny. Let's get into it, shall we? We're sensible people, this country, don't we? <laughs> Down to earth people. Yeah, we never put man on the moon. Nah, nah, the moon was never going to be part of the British Empire, was it, my gentleman? <laughs> oh, nah, nah, there's no one to give it back to once we're done with it, was it? <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Hey, there's nobody to give it back to. It's no sense in taking something or claiming something that's not going to have an Independence Day, right? There's no point going to the moon, putting a railway trial by jury, parliamentary democracy. There's no bastard living there, is there? <laughs> This is a trip. There's nothing to be gained in the way of hot and spicy food or Olympic quality athletes. It's a waste <laughs> of a journey. I mean, why would the British, the very people who invented gravity, want to go somewhere? <laughs> Where there isn't the people that invent the very people that invented gravity. <laughs> all right, all right. That. Clever, I like that. I like that. Gravity. Want to go somewhere <laughs> where there isn't any? Hey, doesn't make any sense at all. Now, the moon should be left to its own business of tides, werewolves, and periods. Tides, no. werewolves. <laughs> if anyone can explain to me the actual difference between them last two, let's <laughs> do later. Now, the point is this. <laughs> One man's silver bullets, like another that. woman's bar of chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> period, period, Neil. That's an example of a word that means different things to you and I, isn't it? It's quite, yeah? Because you're a Yank and I'm British, yeah? 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 That's right. Period, yeah? To the American woman, the word period probably means something like full stop, doesn't it? <laughs> That's the same thing for American geezers, eh, Neil? <laughs> and again, I love him taking and poking fun with the audience, an audience member, especially an American audience member. His... His ability to just take and point out someone that he's had interaction with before and then what he's talking about with the period. I mean, it's two different things. Full stop. Like, you know, it means uncomfortable trips to the grocery store because your wife is, you know, unable to go. Because we're divided by a common language. That's right. And a fucking great big ocean, thank Christ. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> And again, we've got Al Murray, why the British never went to the moon. That was, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> when you look at it the way he put it. I love his take on things, man. He's, number one, not only is he supremely, like, he's highly, highly intelligent. And a lot of history and stuff like that knowledge that he's got. But the fact that he's going, <laughs> nobody to give it back to. Fair point, fair point. <laughs> like, <laughs> nobody to, uh, you know. To, to teach democracy or anything like that to well democracy is the reason why we take our thing supposedly but you know well, that oil but <laughs> there's nobody to you know nothing like you said nothing gained i love that bro this was again al murray is just too funny sometimes man i i, I enjoy his comedy he he's <laughs> this is just another and it's even it's just it's a short clip and he made a little dig about the period. Eh, it's, you know, two different things. You know. I hope y'all enjoyed this. Y'all be good to each other. Love yourselves. Peace.